Hey guys, uh, welcome back to another episode of Two Doc Talk. What episode is this? Like 11, 12, 13? Uh, I think 12, 11. 11? Come here, boy. Uh, we have a couch now. Uh, we uh, got a couch for in my basement for the uh, set. I'd say it could suit up to four people, and we've never had more than four people at a time. So, yeah. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I just... We need more shootings. Shooting? Oh. Oh, so we can talk. So we can talk about more stuff. Hey, I'm joking. But seriously, though, nothing really big that's relevant has happened lately outside of our personal mm -hmm. lives. Like, yeah. nothing really worth talking about, and... And if you're saying stuff like politics, like this politician did this, or that Trump did another big tweet. Yeah. No one wants to hear stuff about politics. And the tweet thing, like, if you ever say something that's ridiculous on a tweet, it's, it's just, it's just, it's happened too many times for it to be, you know, a subject worthy on our show. It's hard to do a weekly podcast when there's not something, it's, it's like debated podcast. They only post something that is worth stuff when there's stuff worth talking about. Like yeah. they said, they'd rather put out no show than a crappy show. You can't even see Justin right now. It just looks like I'm just holding nothing. Yeah, Justin, come here. Justin. Come here, boy. Oh, he comes there. to him. There. Cool. Here. Want to go on the couch? Come on. Oh, he slipped. Come on. Oh, right, Pick him up. There you go. He's just a little tall, though. He, he keeps doing that thing with his legs where he's like, I don't know if I can get up there. Well, my bed is taller than this, so if he can get up my bed with these every day, then he can do it. I mean, he does jump up there. I don't know. I guess maybe he's not just used to it or anything. Maybe. You know? I've seen him do it before with these, though. Alright, <laughs> dude. Now he's gonna he get scared. And then he'll come over here. So... So, uh, he wants to be let outside. The door to outside is right there. Hold on, I'm gonna look up recent news. Let's All right, see. you do that while I let him out. Banter to the camera. So, uh, I'm I'm kind of bored. Uh, let's see what's in the news. I guess. Um, kind of have to pee, but I can hold it. What? You gotta pee. But I can hold it. North Korea threatens to pull out of U.S. summit over military exercises, state-run, blah, blah, blah. I can't read the rest of that. It's, it's got the dot, dot, dot. Ah, so North Korea is doing some classic North Korea stuff. Uh, they, they might pull out of meeting with Trump, I guess, according to CBS. Kim um, Jong-un's penis is continuing to shrink. Hawaii residents near Volcano deal with falling ash, toxic gas, and fears of the big one. So, oh, uh, the Yellowstone one? I don't know. Because that's um, a mega volcano, right? Uneasy calm falls over Gaza after Israel kills scores at protests. Score means 20. Oh, I do remember that. I remember hearing about that one. Uh, Justice Department and FBI are investigating Cambridge Analytica, so that uh, Facebook stuff. Oh, Israel. Doing that. Ooh. You, you Jews. There was an airline co-pilot sucked halfway out of cockpit window. I did hear about that, too. Actually, I heard about that on the Rooster Teeth podcast, where she died, too, afterwards. Uh, not because of the pop up thing, but I think she went into shock or whatever. Uh -huh. And, uh, yeah, her arm and head were, like, sticking out, and then when they find... And they, the guys couldn't pull her back in. It was too strong. When they, she finally got out, uh, she went into shock and died, I think. So, Can you imagine? Apple's CEO, Tim Cook, said Apple Music passed 50 million subscribers. So 50 million people are paying for Apple Music now. Oh, I thought it would be way more than that. Well, I mean, how many people do you think have iPhones and iPods? More than 50 million. Well, yeah, but how many of them are paying for Apple Music? I don't know. I still thought it would be more, though. I would think everyone would Just use that, like, and stuff. iPhone is the most used phone in the world right now. Yeah. Let's see. Ooh, what the critics are saying about Star Wars, uh, about Solo, a Star Wars story. The Han Solo movie. I'm nervous for this movie. Yeah, you said the guy doesn't look like a Han Solo. The guy who's playing Han Solo, I don't think he... Like, based off of what I've seen in the trailer, he doesn't seem like to be a good Han Solo. Like, he just seems yeah. too... 
gay. <laughs> yeah, sure. Can Ron Howard's rescue of a standalone smuggler story fly the odds in the first? Impress critics. Uh, Back to the whole getting sucked out of oh. a window thing. Oh, yeah. Can you imagine that happening? Yes. All right. <laughs> like a window breaks, and you're just flow like flailing. It's like sticking a dog sticking their head out of a car window, but instead it's a plane and it kills you. Because instead of going forty miles per hour, you're going four hundred miles per hour, and really high up where the oxygen's a lot lower, and you're being pulled really hardly, hardly through a hole you can't fit through. So it's basically the same thing. What do you think uh, it's got on Rotten Tomatoes solo? Uh, 80. Don't do that! <laughs> 84%. Would you like to guess again? Is it higher or lower? Guess again. 90. 72. Oh. <laughs> Did he come back because we got shot? No. He wants to play. Hey. Okay. Justin, so, um, Justin came in with energy. Apparently, originally the directors were Phil Lord and Christopher Miller, but they were replaced by Ron Howard weeks before the original shoot was set to end. Wow. So they switched over directors, which isn't a good sign because they did the same thing with uh, Suicide Squad, which was going to be crappy in the first place. we know how that sucked. It was going to be crappy in the first place, but it came out even worse because of that. And because of the editing company they hired, which was trash. Um, and because it sucked. And they ruined the Joker. Mm. So it looks like they're saying it's not a bad movie, but it's not one of the best Star Wars movies. I, 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 yeah, I thought it was going to be up there with the best, with the originals, or e even the recent ones. Even though I don't like them, that, they're okay. They're good movies, but they're not great. Ooh. They're they're good movies, but they're not good Star Wars movies, in my opinion. Oh, you want to hear what this guy said about Solo? Yeah, sure. For the most part, Solo is a conglomeration of set pieces we've seen before, from familiar chase scenes in a battle sequence reminiscent of World War One trench warfare, to a train heist followed by a decent cocktail party thrown in an Art Deco and Art Deco Art Deco. Whatever, inspired space yacht with some tasty callbacks to Star Wars legend and lore thrown into the light, lifelong aficionados. Uh, it gets the job done with little fuss, but also with precious little finesse. It might arguably succeed in teeing up the cinematic narrative that would change movies forever. But in both substance and execution, it bears but a whisper of the revolution. To okay, so basically, it's not been done before, and... You know, it's an okay movie, but there's nothing new, and blah, blah, blah. Wasted potential, I guess. I can see that. It's hard to make original movies, though. Like, especially action movies. Like, everything's been done before. Nothing, almost nothing you do is original. That's why uh, when there is that one, like, a new great original movie, it's like, great. Like, like, the movie It Follows, which came out in 2014, it's a horror movie. We all know most horror movies are basically all the same thing. They just rely on jump scares. There's barely any of that creepy vibe and scare, like, you just, a scary vibe throughout the movie and, like, actual fear that, like, they used to do. And it's basically all just jump scares and special effects now, but, like, It Follows was really unique for its time. 24, it was in 2014, and it was a really unique movie that I thought was really good. And uh, very, even though it was pretty well known, uh, it's, I think it's underrated because it was uh, really well done, and I think it was original and creative. Great movie, and actually scary. But I, like, I don't really get scared by movies, but it's, it's a scary movie. Especially, like, it doesn't rely on jump scares at all, really. And it's still scary. Still creepy vibe and all that shizzle. Uh, I was going to say something else, but I forgot. You hear that? Yeah, I think it's Justin upstairs. What is he doing? I don't know. Um, <clears throat> I don't understand how Rooster the Teeth and Nutsky Hunter do a podcast every single week. I mean, they have more people than us. Yeah, I was going to say, I do. They're a company. But still, like, it, it's still just, they're still just sitting in front of a camera and talking for a couple hours. They, they do it longer than like us. How many people? 
If they play video games. I said there's how many people that oh, are on the podcast? At least four, usually. On rare occasions, they'll have less, and sometimes they'll have more. Yeah, but don't they have, like, games and stuff they'll do? Or not on the should... podcast. Yeah. Well, on the podcast, they just sit in front of a camera for an hour and a half to two hours and a half and talk the whole time. Yeah. And, yeah, there's more of them, but still... Yeah, I mean, there's more of them. When there was more of us, then it wasn't much better. I mean, you, me, Kelsey, and Cabrina. Cabrina barely talked. No offense, Cabrina. We love you. <laughs> I was about to break the sounds, too. It scared the crap, but you need to stop doing that. What? It's so loud. Ugh. It's not loud. It is loud, especially when we're in a... Echoey basement, because mm. there's not much stuff in here. I'm turning this basement. I cleaned it not too long ago. There's a bunch of junk everywhere, but it's super clean now because I cleaned it. And uh, I'm turning it into my man cave slowly. So I just need to find more stuff to put in here. Yeah. Mm. Like, it used to be just storage usage and a bunch of crap down here. And then I put everything in closets and stuff and cleaned it out. And now there's... So much space. I moved, like, in that room over there that I'm sure you guys could find in some of our videos. Uh, look up, look up, uh, what's the, what's the video of that? Joel, 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 look up Joel the Ultimate Cop in that room right there, which is in that video. It used to be just a bunch of crap in there. And that also used to be our band practice room. But then I moved everything out right over there. And that space over there, which I cleaned out, because there's a little more space. And it can come out all the way here. So if we have more than three people jamming. Uh, we have more room now, and uh, I put my old bed in there because I have a new queen size bed finally, which I'm sure you've all seen the video. Because if you watch this video, you're probably watching. You probably watch all our videos, or at least most of them. So, I guess what we what we can start doing is taking video ideas and topic ideas from other people. Like stealing? No, not stealing. Getting suggestions from fans and friends. Oh, yeah. I don't mean, like, look up a different video and, like, oh, they did this, let's do that, too. Even though we've already done that, kind of. Yeah. With a dude course. We talked at some point before about asking people, or, like, having people give a suggestion and then making it into a video. But that never happened. So, let's do it, then. Let's actually I think it was about uh, three years ago, or two or three years ago when we tried that. Then um, we'll do the best ones. Because I know we're going to get a lot of crappy ones. If we ask Barb, my dad's girlfriend, what video should we make about it? She'd be like, well, you could do a video where you go out and have money to homeless people and, you know, be nice to children at parks. <laughs> that might be a little creepy, actually. Yeah. Uh, or if we ask, like, Cabrina, she would say something like, uh, what, what's something she'd say? Go around pantsing strangers. I actually just thought of one. Well, I thought of this earlier. So the we went to Walmart one? today. What's up? Is it the cripple one? Yeah. We were find a wheelchair. Uh, maybe borrow one from a crip. Not the, not a gang member. The uh, Someone that's crippled. <laughs> um, we go around in a wheelchair pranking people. Like, let's say Matthew will sneakily film me while I'll go around in a wheelchair. And then I'll like fall over and see people's reactions or something like that. Or maybe like in a store. Because today... I went in a wheelchair in a store and rode around. And it was fun. Yeah. I'm pretty good at riding a wheelchair, y'all. I was in a wheelchair the whole time, and no one said anything, so I, they probably assumed I was in a wheelchair. And it's funny, Matthew kept insulting me about being crippled the whole time, and sometimes he would do it while all the people around, and they would give him, like, the biggest stink eye, like, did you just say that to <laughs> He was like, that guy looked like he wanted to murder me, because <laughs> he... What did he say to me? Uh... Oh yeah, I, was, I think I was talking about, uh, <laughs> I just said something about walking. Oh yeah, I think I said what, did you go and walk over there? Yeah, it was, I think it was, it was along the lines of like, you know, oh, when you'd have to walk or something. So that like guy that. just thought he insulted a cripple guy for not being able to walk, and he was pissed. And then the wor best part was, he was coming up to me, I dropped something, I couldn't reach it to pick it up because I was in the wheelchair, and he was like, Oh, you can't pick it up, huh? You can't pick it up. He turned around and realized that someone was right there listening to him. And then he was like, too far into it. So he just throws the bag at me. <laughs> You're going to get yourself jumped. We yeah, should... I, I probably am. 
you know. The video can be, we have a cameraman, and I'm in a wheelchair going around, and you come and bully me, and, uh... Yeah, do you remember Octv? Octv. O-C-K. Um, the Bradbury brothers. The Brad... Those blonde guys? Ethan Bradbury. Huh? Ethan Bradbury. Remember that? Do you remember that clip? Maybe. Okay, well... One second. I just looked up, uh... I was curious, so I looked up Apple CEO's net worth. Tim Cook. What is it? Well, hold on, let's see. I wanted to say... I'm guessing it's not as much as Steve Jobs when he, before he died. In 2015, he was worth... Where is it? Here it is. In 2015, he was worth $785 million. Oh, wow. What do you think he's worth now? $5 billion. Five hundred or $400 million. What? He's lost money. How has he lost money? Stocks, I don't know. Jeez. You think you he lost million. I mean didn't fifty cent file file for bankruptcy? Who? Fifty cent. Yeah, I guess. But he's not the CEO of the one of the biggest companies in the world. He's a rapper that isn't relevant anymore. Relevant. Hold on, I'm trying to find the I mean most of his money came from uh vitamin water. Drink vitamin water and it makes you rich kids. Then sell the stock. Run down clip real quick. Let's see. Fifty cent used to be worth over two hundred eighty million dollars. Now what he's worth, it's not quite clear. But he did file bankruptcy, and bankruptcy. If you're bankrupt, it means you owe more than you have, kids. And uh, so they said anywhere between a hundred fifty million, all the way down to f- like five million. But I have no idea how much he's actually worth. I'm Ethan Bradbury. What? Hold on. I'm Ethan Bradbury. Do you not remember that? It was on I'm Vines Ethan and stuff. Bra- I don't know. I'm Ethan Bradbury. No, I'm I don't Ethan remember Bradbury. that. You don't remember that? No, no, I don't know what you're talking about. I've never seen That's that a before. Great meme. I'm even. I'm Ethan Bradbury. I'm Ethan Bradbury. Dude, we've already been going for 17 minutes. Stop. <laughs> Stop what? Man? Shooting your darn gun. I will murder you. That gun. Ah, that's Feel loud. It. it fell in my ears. And I felt the wind in my hands. Man, the wind in my hand. The wind in my hand. The sound in my ear. I'm an airbender. I will murder you. <laughs> I'm a murderer. Come I'm a murderer. Get Come get me. Smile and wave to the cop as I walk out the door. I'm a murderer. Come get I'm me. I'm gonna blow you a little kiss. <laughs> <laughs> uh, we're talking about a key and feel skip. I was just going through my old YouTube downloads. All right. Put the phone down, man. You gotta pay attention to the camera. Are we still filming? Yeah, we're about to hit 20 minutes. Dude, this... <sighs> <laughs> Man, we really need a plan for this and vlogs better. Cause lately, like, we're in the past like three mm-hmm. years of filming. What? Just mm-hmm. <laughs> you're a you're a piece of work. Oh, well, thank in you. In the past three years of filming, we've mainly our main source of content was skits, either comedy mainly, and then horror, and then maybe something else. But usually, it's either comedy or horror. Oh, I was gonna. I say. was talking. <laughs> okay, you were. I was gonna say. I think for next week we should uh, film a short. Maybe on Friday. Okay, that's what you were gonna say. Yeah. <laughs> what, I what remember, about? I, I, wanted, I was gonna say that like um, six hours ago, <laughs> but I forgot. So. I mean, okay. <laughs> Are you gonna elaborate on that, or that's it? Uh, maybe horror short or something. I don't know. Just short or something. So basically, we've been relying on shorts or skits uh, in the past three years because that's our main source of content. And it's the easiest because you don't... Because... Oh, yeah. It's, it's like, you know, it's what we're used to at least. But lately, we've been changing it up where we a vlog, as you guys know, is uploaded yeah. twice a week and we do a, a vlog every Friday or we record it every Friday or Saturday, and we, we put out a vlog every Sunday and a podcast or skit every Wednesday. So we've done podcasts in the past and vlogs in the past, but not nearly this much. Like, before we started doing them frequently, we've had, like, what, 13 vlogs? 
I think so. And before we started doing the podcast frequently, we had like what five podcasts? I think and four. That's like five. I think it's five, including the last one. Oh yeah. So we've had five. So that's in the course of three years, we've had thirteen vlogs and five podcasts, and the rest were all skits or challenges. So I, we are used to doing challenges, but it's hard to come up with ones that haven't been done a thousand times. But we will still do those. But you know. We don't always want to eat something gross or hot, really hot every time we can't think of something. Or what? Oh, I just wanted to put it. Go ahead. Do you want to see the title? Oh, hey. Can I help you? Yeah, I'm ready to order. What do you have? I'll take a... The tingle scoop. What did you say? I said I'll take a... Huh? I heard his order, Mr. Krabs. <laughs> he said he uh. wanted... I'm dead inside. Yeah, I I figured we're all dead inside. None of us are alive. This is all just a a simulation by aliens. This is a good thing to screenshot. Hold on. That's a good face. It's a good face, Mr. Krabs. Well, let me see. You'll see later. Okay. Um, so we're not used to doing weekly vlogs and every other week a podcast. I mean, a podcast would be easy if more stuff happened. And I feel like stuff stopped. I feel like stuff, a lot of stuff, almost every week, would be newsworthy. Right before we started doing the podcast weekly. Mm -hmm. Like, and then all the newsworthy stuff stopped, like, right after we started. Exactly. It's like, oh, they're starting a podcast. They need us to rely on stuff. We're not going to give it to them. Justin, what are you doing? Oof. Oh, I think my dad's home. My dad's home, guys. Ooh, close. So, so uh, look, 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 I'm sure he's been in a vlog or two by now. He was in the most recent one. (laughs) Oh, yeah. He has you walked out on us throwing up. That was fun. Us throwing up, drinking that stuff. I kept it in the fridge for a while after that. I'm like, why is this still here? 12, 7, 19 views. 12, 7, 19? 12,719. Oh, ours overall? Yes. What what are we going to do for 15,000? I don't know. I would say, ever since we started posting the vlogs way more often, then stop shooting it. Ever since we started posting more frequently, our views have been going up a lot, and our views have, like, just at per average video and overall. And, uh, I think we've been getting more subs, even though we just like going up and down. Like, YouTube's been really weird with how, like, it works with subs. Yeah. Like, sometimes it will, like, say, oh, you got a subscriber, and then it doesn't go up. Hi, Dad. Hey. We're recording a podcast. Uh, it's fine. You can say hi if you want. Hi. <laughs> you put a sound thing. Yeah. Recording. You're probably hey, recording a podcast. Hell it, guns. Lock on the door handle. Like and subscribe if, you're, if you don't want to die. If you do want to die, like and subscribe, too. Either way, like and subscribe. If 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 you're gonna if you're gonna do it, like and subscribe first. Yeah, make that the last thing you do, and then your suicide note. Make sure you tell the people reading to like and subscribe to the youtube.com slash the dudes. I was gonna say if someone did do that, we wouldn't get the views from them anymore. So they would have to tell someone to keep up with like a last wish or something. You know, just keep watching us, dude. <laughs> nah. If someone's last wish was to watch this YouTube channel, I'd at least check it out. And then people will realize how great we are and we'll go viral. What are you doing? It looks like there's a zip, but I don't think there is. Maybe it's forming. Let's Maybe stop you're forming. picking it. I am forming to my super saiyan look. <laughs> I want a drum. I think I'm going to drum. No, we're not done with the podcast. And how many minutes are we in? Uh, 
25 at just about. Yeah, 25 is good, man. Let's go for 30. Okay. I don't want, I like it better when we're at least 30, because then people, if it's short and 30, they're like, what are they going to talk about for 20 minutes? I like how our first three or four or five podcasts were all less than 20 minutes. Like, the first one was like 14 minutes. The second one was, I think, even shorter. Uh, the last episode was originally over 45 minutes. It was like 45. We mm. recorded it with, wait, no, we recorded it with my phone. Yeah. We recorded it with my phone, but then it was, since I had the iPhone 4 at the time with 12 gigabytes uh, of storage, it was way too long, so I just, I somehow uploaded it to YouTube. No, I uploaded each clip to YouTube. Mm -hmm. And then I Oh yeah, because I couldn't download it all as one video together after. They're editing. Yeah, because of storage. And then I downloaded it, downloaded those clips last summer, and then I edited, I edited it into a uh, 20, 25 minute, I think. It was like about 25 minutes. Because so yeah. there was a lot in there that wasn't, that didn't matter anymore. It was like... You know, not, none of it really mattered anymore. We're going to be doing this in the future. I guess we could still do some of the original ideas we had for it, like the challenge thing. Like, we asked each other questions, and since I didn't... Since I got a certain amount wrong, I had to pour water in my head. Yeah, we could uh, add that stuff. We'd take more planning. Yeah, but we can start doing it. What do you guys think? Should we uh, add more to the podcast? Comment. Instead of just talking for a half hour to an hour, we can do other stuff, including sitting down and talking. At the end of it, let's say we could do a game, and uh, if one person loses, they get a punishment or something like that. Yeah, and we could it, probably make it more... Formatted like, uh, you know, first 10 minutes, so oh, what's in the news? And then maybe a game. Why are you laying down? You look so. I'm tired, man. I'm tired too. Just, uh. Well, the original one we did, you asked me questions about you. And, uh. I guess next one could be me asking questions about me to you. Or. Or what? Naps. Naps. Matthew's really tired. He He's tired and he wants to drum for some reason. Uh, I haven't drummed in like a while. We probably should have done that before my dad come home, came home. Drum what? Drumming? Mm-hmm. Why? He doesn't care? Yeah, I do. It's loud. <laughs> and it's late. It's almost 11, guys. Yeah, true. Past 10 p.m., you can get in trouble. Yes, yeah, it's, it's past 10. It's like 11. It's like 10.30. I can just do some quiet, jazzy drumming. You know what I'm saying? So, uh, thank you for watching. Do you I guess know what I'm saying? We can go for two more minutes. Do you know what I'm saying? Yeah, I know what you're saying. All right. No, I mean... Matthew is a freak. Dude, can I shoot your finger at this? I guess. Like, there's no bullets in it. I just want to see if, how it sounds. It. Silenced it. It sounded like it went through the whole thing. It didn't silence it as much as I thought it would, though. Ooh, ooh, ooh. This is so chill, lads. Like, we should so add music in the back in the podcast. Yeah, yeah. Add another the calm, many minutes. calm, jazzy music in the background. Oh, that was silence. I think it's because some of the sound comes out of the like, side. Do, 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 do. Yep. Ah. No, I'm just joking. Tell me this hurts. Do it. Oh, that hurt my ears. Tell me this hurts. No. <laughs> Shoot the fly out of the ear. Sure to fly, actually. Yeah, hold on. <laughs> this is such great content. Look at my fly. It's back there, behind the light. Yeah? Well, Matthew's oh. gonna be chasing after this fly now. Dude. My Dude, dad's just like freaking out. My dad's just kind of like, what are they doing? I thought they were recording a podcast, not this is that. how you record a podcast. So, do you guys like vans? I'm wearing vans, uh the high tops. Uh you like my shoes? Yeah. Uh, let me tell you about myself. I'm my name is Timo. I have blue eyes and dark brown hair. I like Movies and music and stuff. Who doesn't? Terrace, that's Ew! Terrace? 
What? Bro? What? Oh god. Ew. Oh, I just drooled some. Um, but yeah, ew. What? A lot of, a lot of spider web right oh, there. Oh wow. So egg sacks and stuff. Did you walk into that? Yeah, I did, and there was a spider on it, and it tried, I mean, my legs tried for you. It tried to get on me, so I, uh, backed up. I almost killed it, too. I'm pretty intense. So, jeez. Here, fly. I'm gonna kill it. Shoot it, shoot it at the spider web. So, there's a spider web on Matthew's drum set. Uh, connected to the wall and his set, and uh, Matthew has a phobia of that, arachnophobia. And, yeah. Ooh, I just shot the spider off the hi-hat. I don't feel like drumming anymore. All right. Thank you for watching. Hold on, I'm just gonna... Wait, hold on, no. Like Shh. and subscribe. Shh. There we go. Share the video and have a great day. Ooh, oh, that is not a pleasant sound. What? He said like and subscribe if you enjoyed the video. Matt! <laughs> Alright, I think that's a good place to stop. <laughs>